So for today, we're going to be looking at the Warlock, specifically the Res Resolute Champion Hood. If you guys don't know, we have already reviewed the Hunter and the Titan sets. They're both right here. You guys can check them out. Definitely some really cool sets. Definitely some inspiring sets, if I say so myself. But we also have already reviewed the actual 2023 set and the 2022 set as well. They're both right here. Uh, really cool videos. I really, really like both of the armors. I do think the 2022 set is a lot better, like just lightning uh laying in a, in a bottle type situation just because the this year's armor is not as good as last year's at least in my personal opinion so let me know what you guys think about the armor sets i am really excited for some of these because now that we're essentially done with the 2023 set we're going to be diving into the 2022 set so whoever commented this don't worry i already have them um already done so i'm really excited to showcase them so let me know what you guys think other than that let's get into it so for the first one, we're going to be using the Helmet Resolute Champion Hood with the Technologic Robes. I really like how these two pair together. They just look really, really cool. The Contender Gloves for the arms, just because I like, not only do I like these arms, but I also like the fact that it's giving me a little bit more of that cloth black that the chest piece has, because I want to have a little bit more of that. And then for the boots, Mind Striders is what we're using. And I'm kind of like saying it like in a surprising way, because I was expecting to use this in something else, but I just loved how both of these just came out together. And because we're using Grand Luster for the shader, I decided to go with the Elect of the Empty Bond just because I feel like that it goes really well together. That being said, I do think the Elect of the Empty Bond would have been better on the last set. You guys will see why I say that in a bit. But overall, I really, really like this set. The Contender Gloves has Abyssinian Gold instead of Grand Luster. Because Grand Luster, I think it was either a white or a gold, and I didn't want that. Again, I want, I wanted a little bit more black in that, so that's why we're using Abyssinian gold in this, and that's why you, my, some of you might have noticed that the chest piece has a different tone, uh, color-wise, than the actual arms themselves. So that's why they look a different, a little, a little different, because they're not using the same shader. But yeah, let me know what you guys think about this one. As for the next set, we're gonna be using Eye of Another World with the Gaze Beyond Worlds ornament. Uh, because apparently people don't know that Eyes of Another World has an ornament. Granted, this is from Warmind, so the, st the second DLC. Actually, yeah, the second DLC. It's very unfortunate that they haven't let this drop because I do think this ornament makes this exotic look even better. Granted, most people are going to tell me, oh, well, it's just a reskin. But the thing that I like about it the most is the fact that it makes the, like, the inside of the hood just completely black with like, this really ominous circle compared to the other one where it's just black or white. I mean, it's just like completely white and I was like, eh, it's fine. But Gaze Beyond Worlds just makes it a lot better. That being said, for this, I decided to go for a really dark tone because obviously the helmet is really dark. So Erebo's Glance for all of this was an easy choice in combination with the cunning of the Contender Robes chest piece. Just looks amazing because if you guys don't know, the actual 2023 set is the arms, the Resolute Champion gloves. I, I'm okay with the arms, definitely like not as great as it could have been. Uh, but the reason I wanted to use the the contending or the cunning contender robes is because the arms has a little bit of a glow and I was like, fuck it, let me just dive into the glows and it, cunning, cunning of the contender, just all of it is, is that. So I find that a little funny, but I also just think this looks really, really cool with the caveat being the chest piece has that like red, yellow, and blue, the class colors that don't change color. That's the only thing that's unfortunate about this whole set. For the boots, arc light boots, I just wanted to use that just because I like the, the geometry of the boots with the chest piece. I think it looks really cool. And then Dawn Singer Bond because uh, the glow is orange and I decided, fuck it, let's go for an orange look. And Eye of Another World is class agnostic. So you could use, do this with a solar look or any look to be fair, you don't have to do a solar to solar it's just that's my where my head would go like if you want to continue that like i'm using solar therefore that's why the colors are this that's that's really just me though because i'm dumb like that but yeah let me know what you guys think about this one for the next one we're going to be using the chess piece resolute champion robes and surprisingly i like the chess piece a lot and i say surprisingly because i thought i wasn't going to like it but thankfully it not only shaders really really well but it also gives a really cool vibe to the whole like look of it. So for the helmet, Hardened Basilisk headpiece was what I went with because I want some glow in there. And then for the arms, Painted Kitsune gloves specifically because I'm combining this with the alternate conduction ornament for the Geomag stabilizers. 
and that one has a lot of like electrical currents going through it so i decided ah let's go with painted kitsune uh gloves because i know that does that and you can change the color if you want which is why we're using the omnicronia shader because i wanted that blue glow and omnicronia is like the best one that i think of when it comes to blue glows and it looks super badass so like i don't i don't i hope i don't have to explain this because this should look fire to me and then for the bond arc light bond is what we're using surprisingly because when I reviewed the arc light armor for the warlocks, which you guys will see right here, I did not like it. Like I hate that bond a lot. It's just the fact that it has electrical currents going through it. So that's why I decided to go with it. But I would probably just switch this out for something else to be quite honest. Like you don't need the like the currents on the arm cause the, or on the bond cause the arm and the boots have enough of it where it's like fine. But I was like, eh, fuck it. Let's just throw the rock in there. And last but not least, we're using the Astrocyte Verse. This one is super, super dope. I love this one. The rich purple you get from Welded Brass is so, so cool. And I know people are going to jump on this because it is a rich purple. For the Arms Technologic Gloves, because I wanted a little bit more cloth in there because uh, the boots has a lot of plate. And not, not like a lot, a lot, but like enough where I was like, I want a little bit more cloth to like even it out. And speaking of boots, Resolute Champion Boots is what we're using, which is the 2023 set. The contender robe is actually the 2021 set. No, the, yeah, the 2021 set, which is super, super cool. And then the Lux bond, uh, because there's purple in there. And I, now that I look at it, it's probably a good thing that I didn't put the elect of the empty, uh, or bond, the, the purple one from the first set, just because now that I'm looking at it, it's not the same purple. This one is a much more blue purple compared to the other one, which was more of a, like a pink red purple. So I'm kind of happy that I didn't go with that because I, yeah, that would not have gone well. It just, I don't think it's, yeah, it's not the same purple, very much a red purple compared to this purple. So I am happy that I didn't do that, but yeah, I think this set looks super, super cool. I know people are going to be like, oh, you, I bet you don't use Astro Sight Verse. I actually do use Astro Sight Verse. For, so for me, this is a banger. You look like, like a galactic Olympian. Like it's so cool. I love it. So warlocks let me know what you guys think in the comments below i really really like this set a lot it's like super super dope uh next up is gonna be the 2022 set last year's set and i'm gonna be real with you guys i i'm in love with those sets those sets are super super dope the hunters i think got some bangers warlocks y'all got some bangers as well titans you guys i have not made your armor sets yet but because that armor is such a banger of a set i can tell you with 1000 percent uh confidence that that set's gonna be fire as well so let me know what you guys think. Again, I appreciate you guys coming up to this point, especially those who actually like, comment, subscribe, all of that. Really, really appreciate it and really does help my channel a lot. So again, really appreciate y'all. Be safe. I will see you guys later.